Hey guys, what is up? It's Card Shuffler 99 here today. I'm going to be revealing Matt Franco's trick he performed on the quarterfinals of America's Got Talent this year. So, guys, before we get into this, a couple things first. Um, if you guys do not want to know how this trick is done, uh, I suggest you guys just stop watching the video and go to a different video, guys, or stop watching YouTube. But if you guys do not want to know how this is done, please just... Do not watch this video and go from there. Now, guys, if you do want to know how it's done, just stick around. And also, if you guys have not seen the performance, I really suggest you guys watch the performance. It's really cool. It's a really cool trick. And I'll go ahead and before we get into it, make sure if you are interested in getting some free gift cards, all you have to do is click the link in the description for free my apps. Click that link, download free apps. You guys can get free gift cards. Also, the if you guys want to be entered in our August giveaway. We are giving away eighty dollars in Amazon gift cards. So if you want to be entered, there will be um, eight winners. Each winner getting ten dollars. If you guys want to be entered, all you have to do is like this video. You have to be subscribed to the channel. Notifications have to be on. You have to comment one time on one video. What do you guys like about our channel in that specific video? And you guys will be entered and have a chance to win. Winners will be announced on the last day of August. And let's go ahead and get into the reveal. So in case you guys. Let's go ahead and sum this trick up real quick. It's the trick with the uh, milk carton. So basically it's a milk carton and he pours it into six different cups and it changes into different liquids and the judges taste it and it tastes real. So that is the trick basically summed up there guys and let's, let's learn how to do this. So guys, I'll actually be demonstrating a little something today but before we get into that, let's actually learn how he set this up and what he has to do. So guys, this is how it's going to work. So from the beginning of the trick, he actually has to preset this milk carton. So guys, this milk carton is preset, and I'll explain that in a little bit. So basically, what this means by what I mean by preset is the whole entire milk carton is 100% filled with water. All right, guys, the whole entire milk carton, once again, it's filled with water. All right, and from here. He actually has to do a little bit of a setup. He actually will, before the trick even starts, measure out the exact amount of water he needs to fill up each cup to the, you know, the certain point, right? You know, close to the top, but not all the way to the top. So he'll actually measure out each cup of water. And, you know, before, before the trick even starts, put it in the milk carton, guys. And basically, he's set from there. Now... Let's explain how the liquids change. Now, guys, before we even get into this, I'm going to just tell you guys now, it's powder. So I'm going to explain this, guys, really quickly. So there is actually a lot of powders. So there's there's actually beer powder, orange juice powder, powder red wine, milk. There's all of the um, drinks he used in the uh, liquids he used in the performance. Here you can actually see this is... Uh, Nutri Cargo guys. This is actually a company that actually makes orange juice powder and red wine powder and probably multiple other powders out there too. So guys, if you guys didn't know, there is orange juice powder, there is red wine powder, there is milk powder, lemonade powder guys, that's pretty obvious, and also beer powder. Now if you guys actually go onto Google right now, you guys can actually look up um, powder beer guys and if you click images, a couple pictures down, there will actually be a picture of a glass of beer, and there will be a um, little, little almost thing that looks like a sugar packet, and it just says just add water. So guys, all of these uh, powders work by just adding water to the powder, and the powder will, you know, just work by itself, and you guys get the point. So now we got to point out a couple of things. You guys will also notice that from here he has. Here I have water, and here I have um, the lemonade powder. You guys will actually notice every time he picks up a cup, except the water cup, he picks it up in a certain way. And this way is, now guys, even before that, he, each cup is on the tray. And if you notice the, 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 um, where you put the cup, it's actually indented a little bit. So we cannot see the very bottom of the cup. Because it's, you know, put into the tray in the little cup holder thing, right? So there's a little circle, and the cup goes right in there. And we can't see what's below this point. And every time Matt Franco, credit to him for this really cool trick, every time he picks up a cup, 
he picks it up like this, so he picks it up, you know, with his first two fingers, and he covers the whole entire bottom of the cup so you cannot see anything. Now, guys, clearly from this angle, you guys can see what I'm doing. But let's just change the angle a little bit. Pretend you can't see anything from right, you know, below that line right there, and he picks it up like this. You guys can't see anything. It just looks like a clear cup. Now, every time he picks it up like that, except for the water cup, which he doesn't need to pick it up like that because he needs the powder for the beer, the lemonade, the orange juice, red wine, and milk. Yes, guys, he needs the powder for those, but he does not need the powder or the water. And the reason is, guys, he doesn't need the powder for the water is because there's already water in the milk carton, if in case you guys have forgotten. So basically, he's just pouring water into the cup. And during that one, he actually shows the cup just a little bit to the camera, and you can see there's nothing in there because nothing has to be in there. But for all the other cups, he's covering like this, and you guys can't see anything that's happening. So from here, guys, another thing you will notice is the camera actually never shows him pouring it into the um, pouring it into the cup except one time. So like you can't really see the stuff that's coming out of the milk carton into the cup. You can't see that. He's always hiding it. Like you can't see it perfectly, except for one time. At the time, if you guys watched his performance, at the time exactly one minute and thirty-one seconds that they posted on America's Got Talent that performance. If you guys pause it at that perfect point, you guys will actually notice that when he's pouring it, like he's pouring it into the um, cup, you actually see the stuff coming out. This is uh, when he was pouring it, the uh, liquid into lemonade. He was actually pouring out a clear liquid water. You can actually see it's water. And then two seconds later in the cup, you see it's all blurry and it looks like lemonade. That's because, if, if you guys want to watch right now, I'll go ahead and do this now. Now clearly this isn't going to be the same color lemonade he had. This is going to be yellow. This is actually just Gatorade uh, lemonade powder. So I'm going to go ahead and do this now. So guys, as you can see, it will actually instantly turn into lemonade. So let's go ahead and do this right now. So we go ahead, we just pour it in at a decent pace, and you can go ahead and see it's yellow and it looks exactly like lemonade. So that's how all of the powders work. So this, the instant water makes contact with these powder, with this uh, powder, it instantly just turns into that, you know, drink. Beer, water, orange juice, red wine, you, you guys get the point. Now, another thing you guys have to notice is when he's pouring it into there, once again, guys, he's very careful about the angle he's pouring it in. When he's pouring it in, the camera angle doesn't allow you to see, except that one time that he's pouring in water. You can't see the clear liquid there. So every time except that last time, you guys can see that, and you guys get the point from there. So basically, it's just powder. He's pouring the powder into the cup, and he's hiding the powder at the bottom of the cup the whole time, and you can't see anything. Now, guys... These powders will make the, um, when they're mixed with water, they will actually taste like the actual drink, which is really cool. Now, guys, if you pour water into a powder and you taste it right away, right, it might, it might be a little uneven. You guys know what I mean? Like, it might not be distributed, like, perfectly yet. So, if you guys buy a little bit of what Matt Franco did is he bought a little bit of time. Uh, he spent about a minute or two, you know, he walked around. And what that's doing, that's buying him time for the powder to actually mix a little bit more. So he's walking around and, you know, the cups are shaking a little bit. You guys get the point. He's buying himself time. They don't drink it for another, like, two minutes after he poured it or something like that, guys, or a minute. So he, it's actually just buying him some time to simply allow the mixture to, I guess you could say, or the powder to mix in with the water and that will allow it to actually taste like, you know, beer, lemonade, milk, water. You guys get the point. So that is how it works. It instantly turns into the uh, drink you wanted to, guys. So I think that's really cool. You guys can actually perform this trick you, yourself if you guys want to. All you have to do, it's pretty simple, is just buy the powders. Now, you can use, you know, different powders. You don't have to use lemonade or milk or any, any of those powders. If you guys just find a random powder, it will basically work. And as you guys can see here, it worked really well. So... Guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, let us know what you guys think in the comment section below. Do not forget to enter the contest. And also, make sure you check out all of our other AGT America's Got Talent reveals. 
because we are going to be revealing every other magician on the uh, show. So thank you guys so much for watching once again. And this is Card Shuffler 99. Peace out.